Honey, mm. you got a word on your head. <coughs> oh no, Mommy, give me a hint. It's something you do to me all the time. Bite? <coughs> Punch? <coughs> Answer carefully. You're only allowed two wrong guesses. It's something you do with your eyes. Side eye. Sweetie, you got it. Oh no, Mommy. You got a word on your head. Hurry, give me a hint. It's a horror movie. Scream? No. Smile? No, it's one of the greatest horror movies of all time. It was made like a long time ago. Halloween. No, Mommy, it was the Botha. Grandma, stop stealing my makeup. I was almost late getting ready this morning. You've got a word on your head. Hurry, Grandma, give me a hint. People often say that you are... Perfect. Stunning. Oh, no, I only have one guess left. You have to guess something that you are, not aren't. Give me another hint. POV Tic Tacers are... POV Tic Tacers are... Cringe! I got it correct. But just so you know, Grandma, POV Tic Tacers are not cringe. Where did those sunglasses come from? Hey, Eugene, wait. I need to copy your homework. You can't copy me. That's cheating. You have a word on your head. Give me a hint. I'll guess it, no problem. It's something you don't have. Friends? No. When someone's a charming person, they're... Insufferable. Okay, Eugene, watch me. Treat me like what it is. Don't get me dirty. What is this? It's embarrassing. No, Eugene, it was Riz. Brianna. Not now, Sophie. I'm super late to class. You got a word. Hurry, give me a hint. It's something you drink. Water. Juice. Carefully, you have one guess left. It's a white liquid. Your dad went out to get what and then never came back. <laughs> What are these hearts on my face for, Mom? The hearts represent how many people must fall in love with you before you can meet your soulmate. When they fall in love, you lose a heart. What's the gold heart for? That represents your soulmate. You'll only lose the gold heart when your soulmate falls in love with you. <laughs> Hi, Jake. What do you want? I really like your left elbow. <laughs> what does that even mean? Get out of here. Oh, no. What's wrong? I need five people to fall in love with me. Look at me. It's never going to happen. I'm a loser. You're not a loser. You're beautiful. You just need a makeover. Come with me. Who's that fine babe over there? Where? <laughs> He's talking about you. Oh. Thank you. <laughs> Don't snort. I I think I'm in love with you. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. Brianna, you lost a heart. You really do love me. We should go on a date sometime. I'm sorry, Jake, but... I don't think I'm your type. I'm Brianna. Who? The weird girl. <laughs> There's no way that's you. Goodbye, Jake. You're doing great. You already got someone to fall in love with you. Yeah. Isn't it great? I told you not to snort. I only need three more people to fall in love with me, and then I can meet my soulmate. Look, there's a guy right there. What do I do? Wink at him. Act cute. Play with your hair a bit. Whoa, is everything okay here, little man? Uh, yeah, I'm okay. I was actually trying to flirt with you. <laughs> oh, you were? I thought there was something wrong with you. Hey, my name's Jason. What's yours? Brianna. We should exchange numbers. Okay. You lost another heart. No way. Your makeover's working great. Hey, Bri. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Your makeover's working great. Hey, Bri. <laughs> Stop. If you want to get boys, you can't be friends with Kevin anymore. Brianna, look at this insect I found. <laughs> wow, let me see. Brianna, tell him. Kevin, I'm sorry, but we can't be friends anymore. I'm trying to get boys to fall in love with me, so I can't be seen with the weird guy. I really hope that getting boys and being popular is worth losing who you are. So after class, we'll go looking for the next guy. Brianna, don't wear your glasses. I can't see anything. Why do I have to change everything about myself to get boys to like me? Why can't I just be me? Brianna, wait. This is just so boys will fall in love with you so you can find your soulmate. Once you find your soulmate, you can go back to being yourself again. And who's to say my soulmate's going to love me for who I am? No one else does. Brianna, you lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. You lost another heart. You're almost there. But how? I haven't talked to anyone new. Hey, Brianna. Your grades have been doing phenomenal. You're looking really good these days. I like your new look. I'll see you in class. Do you think it was Mr. Stevens that fell in love with you? For his wife and kids' sake? I hope it's not him.
Okay, right in front of you, that's Chad. He's one of the hottest guys in the school. Go up to him and ask if he would like to attend Devin's party with you. Kevin's walking this way. So? Hi, Kevin. Don't talk to me. You're too cool for me, remember, Brianna? <laughs> Brianna, what are you doing? Go talk to Chad. Right. Chad. Hi, what's your name? I'm not sure we've met before. <laughs> Stop! Boys don't like it when you cry! I don't care! I don't care about Chad! I'm in love with Kevin! Is Kevin more important than your soulmate? He is! Then go to him! Kevin, I- Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend! Me too! <laughs> I love you, Cynthia! Kevin, I'm so glad we're finally boyfriend and girlfriend! Me too! <laughs> I love you, Cynthia! How'd it go with Kevin? Did you tell him you like him? He likes someone else. Brianna, you lost your last heart. Someone else fell in love with you. Chad. No, it wasn't Chad. It was me. Oh? Not in a romantic way, in a platonic way. I fell for you when I saw that you stay true to yourself and know what you want. The only person left to fall in love with you is your soulmate. That means I'm going to find my soulmate anytime now. That's the girl I remember. <laughs> it's so great to be myself again. Hey, do you mind if I sit next to you? Uh, okay. Does anyone know the answer to this equation? 7,422. Girl who knows her math. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> it's you. What? Nothing. Congrats on finding your soulmate and getting him to fall in love with you. What's this? It's a list of all the people who fell in love with you before your soulmate. The third person on the list is Kevin. I got you the new dolly you wanted. Thank you. I love... Stop. You can't ever say I love Y-O-U. If you say it to someone who's not your soulmate, you'll lose all memory of the person you said it to. Hey, baby, I got you lunch. Aw, thank you, babe. You're amazing. I think it's time for us to say the L word. But Evan, what if you're not my soulmate? I don't want to forget you. It's okay. You don't need to forget me. I'll just say it then. I love you. Evan? Um, who are you? How do you know my name? I'm your girlfriend. I don't even know you. You're not my girlfriend, you bitch. Hey, Emily. Evan told me he loved me today. Brianna, that's great. He forgot me. Oh, no. I need to make him fall for me again. Even if we're not soulmates, I don't want to lose him. <coughs> Emily? Evan? Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. Love you. Emily, how could you kiss Evan? I love him. And I? Brianna, don't say it. Love you. No, Brianna! Brianna! Hmm? How do you know my name? Uh, I'm not sure, but my name's Emily. It's nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Hey, Brianna, I really like your sweater. It's so cute. Thank you. It's new. I just bought it. My ex just came in. He told me he loved me today and then forgot me. Whatever. Don't worry about him. You deserve so much better. Thanks, but how would you know? You don't even know me. I don't have to know you. It's obvious. Did you see? Evan was looking at you the whole class. Whatever. He lost his chance. Hey, Emily? Yeah? I never forgot you. What? I never forgot you. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop singing. Where did you learn to sing? I don't know. I just heard it on the TV. You only sing when you want to kill someone. They play that on the TV because they want you to sing, but you can't, okay? Okay. Honey, are you off to school now? Yeah, I am. You forgot to wear your earplugs. You must always keep them on while you're in public. Do I have to wear them? It's for your protection. You never know when someone could start singing. Hey, girl. Hey. Ouch. Now I got your attention. What? Keep out those earplugs. I want to talk to you. My mom makes me wear them. She says you never know when someone could start singing. Come on, hand them over. We're at school. No one would start singing here. Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of- Help! Oh! Ring around the rosies, a pocket full of- Help! Oh! Rosies, ashes. Here's your earplugs back. I was wrong. You might actually need them. I saw someone die. Was it just him or were there others? There were three others who didn't cover their ears in time. Hey, they canceled school for the day. Go home and get some rest. Mom, I'm home. Mary had a little lamb. Emily, little stop lamb, singing. Little lamb. Emily, Mary why are you singing? I told you not to. It kills people. Lamb, its fleece was white Mom! 
Mom, there's something wrong with Emily. She won't stop singing. She's going to kill someone. Mary had a little lamb. Why are you singing? Little lamb. I need to get out of here. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, babe. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Rock. Goodbye, baby. Why is everyone singing? Attention all citizens. Singing has now become contagious. You must wear earplugs at all times to stop the spread. Mary had a little lamb. Rock a bye baby on the treetops. Ashes, ashes. Everyone's singing. Hey, take out your earplugs. What? It's just me and you. It's just us? Yes. Okay. Ring around the rosies. Sweetie, is it time for school? Yes, I think so. Sweetie, you need to ask, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It's 8 a.m. It's time for school. Mmm, lunchtime. Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 12 p.m. It's time for everybody to eat lunch. Except, Timmy, it's time for Timmy to be my lunch. No, Mr. Wolf, please! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Mr. Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for me to eat you. <laughs> Brianna, you need to ask Miss Wolf what time it is. Hurry! What, what time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 3 p.m. It's time for everyone to go home. It's time to go home. I'll see you tomorrow, bestie. Stay safe. You too. Mom, I'm home. I'm so hungry. Mom, is it time for dinner? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 5 p.m. It's time for me to have my dinner. <laughs> Sissy, where's mommy? It's time for dinner. She's just sleeping. Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? Why is there a timer above my head? Sissy, hurry. You need to ask. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Ask what? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? Mr. Wolf! Mr. Wolf! Uh-oh. Looks like little sissy ran out of time. It's time to be my no. meal. <laughs> Go away. What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 9 a.m. It's time for school. You're late. I don't care. I'm not going. My mom and sister are gone. What? What time is it, Mr. Wolf? It is 9 a.m. It's time for you to go to school. I told you I'm not going. Honey. Mm, uh... Oopsies. Uh-oh, you got a mark. Five mistakes and you're out. Out? Like... Yes, exactly. Two plus two. Brianna, what's the answer? Um... I can't answer it. I don't want to make a mistake. I know the answer. It's three. <laughs> that was Timmy's fifth mistake. Five mistakes and you're out. Brianna, hold this. What is wrong with you? Why did you get that to me to hold when I wasn't ready? Chill out. It's no big deal. No, I can't chill out. I have two marks now. Three more and I'm out. Giving her that hold was a mistake. What? How was that a mistake? Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Um, no, that's my last mistake. You still have three left. It was her mistake. Not mine. <laughs> hey, guys. You can't sit with us. Why not? The reason Sophie's dead. You let her die so you didn't get another mark. Why should I get a mark? 
I wasn't the one who made a mistake. Five marks and you're out. You're so selfish. Your shoelaces are untied. Hmm? Why would you do that? Sir, she made a mistake. She forgot to tie her shoelaces and then she tripped. What? No, you tripped me. You're now the school's target. That's what you get for killing Sophie. You're gonna be next. I may have caved and texted my ex-boyfriend at 2 a.m. that I miss him. He replied with, I'm over. I didn't go, okay? I don't need a baby. This is going to tell me if my ex is the one I'm meant to be with or not. I'm gonna take that as a no. Oh, another day, another charge. <clears throat> what? Mom, I need to buy your charger. No, I'm using it. I'm only at 10%. I'm going to die. Here, hurry up. <clears throat> it's not working. Let's try this. That's the emergency charger. This is an emergency. <clears throat> it didn't work. There must be something wrong with my charging port. Did I hear something wrong with the charging port? Hold still. Hold what? <clears throat> what happened? You made it worse. I'm at 2% now. There's one more thing we can try. Come with me. Wait. Honey, did you just use the bathroom? <laughs> no. Oh no, you aged. You were lying. You can't ever lie because every time you lie, you get older. Look, I dyed my hair green. Ah! Looks really good. It doesn't look like I've aged. Hey, Eugene, I didn't do the homework. Can you give me all the answers? Brianna, are you trying to cheat? No. Hey, Sophie, I've lied twice today and I haven't aged at all. I think I'm immune. No way, you're so lucky. Hey, Timmy. You're handsome. Thanks, Brianna. That's so nice of you. And Jimmy, those are really nice shoes. Really? You think so? I said so many lies today, and I haven't aged at all. Look in the mirror. Ah! Good morning. Good morning. It's time to take your medicine. Bombastic side eye. No, Miss Applewood. There'll be no side eyeing today. Now take your medicine. <sighs> you really thought you ate that? No, I don't. But you need to eat medicine. No, I don't want my medication. I want girl dinner. After you take your medicine. Girl dinner. No, please don't sing it again. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. All right, unplug your life support. Sap wood, you soiled yourself. Come on, let's go and get you cleaned up. No, I'm in my pooping my pants era. What happened to your clean girl era? Let's bring that back. Clean girl aesthetic. Exactly. Now let's go get washed up. You're giving me ick. You're giving me the ick because you smell so bad. Where'd you get that? What are you eating? My husband. Today, we will be making our last girl dinner. Miss Applewood, are you on your phone again? Your grandchildren don't want you to have too much screen time. Mind your business, Susan! What is our dessert? Moldy muffins. Yes, that's my favorite food. I need my glasses. Cake? No, no, no. Too sweet. Too sweet. Need some mold on it. Pizza? No, no. Too cheese. Too much cheese! No! Yes. Yes. Toenail clippings. What's my drink? Wash it all down with the 7-Up. Good. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. How much? Delectable. Red olives? All right. No, 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 no. I'm not taking my vitamins. Miss Applewood, you need to take your vitamins. No, I told you I'm not taking my vitamins, Susan. <laughs> See, this is why I told you to stop yelling so much. I don't yell. Anyways, scrumdiddlyumptious. Applewood, your grandchildren are here to see you. Tell them to go home. I'm busy. You're not busy. I'm trying to see what kind of dog I am. Ah! Hey, I will be seeing who has a crush on me. Six, five. <laughs> I would climb that like a tree. Miss Applewood, what did you say? No one's talking to you, Susan. Bartender, I don't know because I'm a material girl. He doesn't make that much money. Cancer, oh, he's a 10 out of 10 in looks. <laughs> no one ever have a crush on you, Miss Applewood, because you're not a very nice lady. That's not true, Susan. I have a husband. Go team! I knew you would win, Jake. Of course I won. You were cheering me on. Look, it's Porky the Pig. 
get it? Because you're fat. <laughs> My name's not Porky. It's Cynthia. Porky, I can smell your Big Mac scented sweat from over here. Stinky, funky, like, ew. Why are you so mean? <laughs> Why am I so chubby? How did I gain so much weight in a day? Oh no, did you make someone insecure? You were born with a curse. If you make someone insecure, you'll get their insecurity. So you're saying I'm stuck like this? I'm ready for cheer! Brianna, you really let yourself go. Yeah, don't worry about it. I'll lose weight in no time. Well, until you do, you can't cheer with us. Are you serious right now? <laughs> I'd like to audition for the cheer squad. Porky, you're skinny? I told you, my name's Cynthia. Wait. Cynthia, I should apologize. Mommy, when is Daddy coming back with the milk? It's been two years. Stop crying. <laughs> I said stop. You're making it rain. You're six now, so it's time you know. You were born with a curse. Whenever you cry, it rains. You can't tell anyone about this because they might judge you for your curse. I can't believe Derek broke up with me. Aw, <laughs> Brianna, it's going to be okay. Come on, let's get you home. It's raining. Let's wait till it stops. No, no, it's okay. It will stop raining now. The rain actually stopped. How did you know it would stop raining? I have to tell you something. I was born with a curse. Whenever I cry, it rains. But you can't tell anyone about this, okay? They might judge me for it. Cry, baby. <sighs> Why would you do that? Come on, cry. I want to see it rain. How do you know that? I'm sorry. I told them. Ooh, mommy's makeup. No! You can't ever put anything on your face. Anything that touches your face becomes permanent. Now that blush will be on you forever. What? Mom really wasn't lying. It's never gonna come off. Hey, Brianna, you got some lipstick on your cheek. Here, use one of my makeup wipes. No, it won't come off. Anything that touches my face is permanent. Why? <laughs> Brianna, you're so funny. Want to come over to my slumber party tonight? Sure, I'd love to. What should we do now? How about a pillow fight? Ah! <laughs> Good night, everyone. I'm so tired. I'm going to bed. Night. Sleep tight. <laughs> Good morning, guys. <laughs> Why are you laughing? Here, you need to look at yourself. You look so silly. Do you know what you guys just did? Black heart, red heart, black heart, red heart, black heart, red oh, heart. Oh, honey, you got your hearts. Yay! Now you must choose one, but whatever you do, don't choose the... I want the black heart. It reminds me of death. No! You made a big mistake. The black heart means if someone falls in love with you, their heart will die. But the red heart means if someone falls in love with you, their heart will continue beating. Now you can never find love. Because if someone falls in love with you, they'll die. Timmy! I'm gonna be the princess, you be the prince, and we're gonna get married. We're getting married? <laughs> it's just for pretend. <laughs> Timmy! Timmy? No, what happened to Timmy? He's sleeping, I think. No, he's not sleeping. He must have fell in love with you. Hey, my name's Jason. I just moved here. I could really use a friend. I'm Brianna. Oh no, you have a black heart. Oh no. You have a black heart. So? Why does it matter? You said you just wanted a friend. Nothing bad will happen to you as long as you don't fall in love with me. Sorry, but I'm not going to risk it. Here's your test back, Brianna. Thanks, Mr. Stevens. Look at your grade. Yes, I got another A. Your grades have been phenomenal recently. Keep up the good work. What happened to Mr. Stevens? Mr. Stevens! He must have fell in love with Brianna. Oh, who's gonna grade the homework? She shouldn't be allowed in the school. You guys think I want to live this way? It's not my fault. Hey girl, how are you doing? I'm so glad you're friends with me, Sophie, because no one else will be. Take it as a compliment. Everyone's scared they'll fall in love with you. I'm going to be alone forever. I have an idea. You could hide it. How? Here, cover it with this red heart and tell everyone that you got your heart changed from black to red. No one will ever find out. <laughs> 